if you guys remember when Bob Iger made some statements in regards to Disney firing a lot of people and canceling things, well, one of the stars from Disney that did not take anything he said lightly was Tatiana Mislani, aka She-Hulk, who went on an interview and said that his demands are unrealistic and that he is completely out of touch and an old man. Now she reflects on her comments. So let's just go over what happened. When Bob Iger came back and took over for Bob JPEG, he decided that things were going to go in a different direction. AKA cancel projects, scrap projects outright, sometimes start selling off IPs to others, try to make a quick buck. Then the writer and actor strike started, and Bob Iger would say that Disney cannot feasibly afford to pay the actors and writers what they think they deserve. Which, if you guys remember, was literally less than 1% over 5 years of Disney's revenue. Yeah, so she decided to go out there and call him a old man that's completely out of touch. So recently in an interview with The Independent, she reflected on this and said, well, in those moments you're heated up. It's hard to properly articulate what you're trying to say, so you just say something like that, and there you go. And she says that it's still something that she believes and feels strongly about. She's not going back on it. She thinks it's insane that it got to this. That Disney couldn't afford less than a quarter of their profits a year to pay everybody what they're worth. Now, obviously, ever since then, things have changed, and there's going to be residuals and certain things to happen but it's still nowhere near what most people believe they should be getting paid especially with ceos like Iger, who are making more and more every year but all they're doing is making less content you know so i get what she's saying what everybody's still saying it's something that's here so we'll see what happens but remember she hulk season two also isn't happening and a lot of people blame her comments on it not happening. When that's not the fact, it's the budget that did it in. Because She-Hulk cost as much as an Avengers film. Which is insane. 